Hello, welcome back to my channel. It is Amanda. Today I have the Salon Perfect Dip and Dots collection to show you. I saw a few people post these on Instagram and I thought I need to find these because I need more neons in my life. I don't have a lot of neons. That's a lie. I have a lot of neons, but I love neons. And I really like Salon Perfect nail polishes. And these just look so cute. They're sort of like bleached neons. There are eight polishes in this collection. I purchased these at Walmart. They were $3.98 each. A very good price for a full-size nail polish, IMO. Let's get to the swatches. I want to show you the polishes in alphabetical order. I hope that the colors are coming across okay because they are neons and because they are sort of that bleached neon, it's very difficult to accurately capture the color. And because I swatch at night, I can't always get the most accurate color swatches. So I will try to take bottle shots of the polishes during the day so you can actually see a slightly more accurate color. I don't do color correcting for my photos. I literally crop and watermark them. So, you know, different lighting affects how polishes look. I'm sure you know that. But if you use warm lights in your house, that affects how things look. If you use cool, you know, it, it all affects how everything looks, not just nail polish, but I just want to let you know that. So, so I'm gonna take bottle shots today. It's actually sunny today. Amazing, so we're using some natural light. These are the swatches, let's get to them. The first is called Banana Split, and this is the yellow of the bunch. I don't know what I was trying to say there. It's not a highlighter yellow, but it's pretty bright yellow. This one covers in three coats. I honestly would have been shocked if I needed anything less than three coats for a neon yellow. Yellow in general is pretty much always a three coater and definitely a neon so this one had an okay formula it, you know it's it's a yellow so they're typically pretty streaky but it didn't run it wasn't thin it didn't pool on my cuticles the formula itself was fine but it was just a little bit streaky at the second coat so there's three coats of banana split the next palette is called berry freeze and this is a light blue but slightly purple leaning <laughs> blue it's not periwinkle but there is a hint of purple in this and this one had a really nice formula it covered in two coats it's not as neon so that it helps it it performs more like a, a light cream polish so that definitely improves the formula i don't know why neons are so difficult they're so beautiful just work with us, Nia. So that is two coats of Berry Freeze. The next polish is called Birthday Cake, and this is a brighter pink. This isn't the most neon pink I've ever seen, but it's a bright pink polish. This one, again, covers in two coats. It has a really nice coverage, very good opacity, and no streaks on this. So that is two coats of Birthday Cake. The next polish is called Cool Mint, and this is a pastel bleached neon mint. <laughs> it's not quite neon. It's like in between pastel and neon. It's not quite just pastel, but there's there's enough brightness to this that it's, it's in that bleached neon territory. This one is a two to three coater. I can see you definitely need three coats if you have long nails or like me, ridges in your nails. Two of my nails needed two coats, two needed three. So two to three coats for Cool Mint. Next we have Cotton Candy, and this is an aqua blue uh, cream polish. This one also covers in two coats. Really nice coverage on this one. Very opaque, not streaky. This one was lovely, so that's Cotton Candy. Now we have some more like truly, truly bleached neons, I would say. This is called Lime Ice. This is a bleached lime cream polish. This one also covers in two coats. It has a really great formula. No streaks, even coverage, no running, pooling, you know, none of those things. And uh, I love this. I love this. That is Lime Ice. And then we have Orange Cream. This is a coral orange cream polish. Again, two coat polish. Really, really lovely formula. I, I think I was kind of expecting all of these to need three coats. Two coats of Orange Cream. 
And then lastly we have a strawberry, I don't I almost said strawberry pearl, strawberry swirl. I think I'm having a stroke. Like, I don't know what's wrong with my brain. We're not running on all cylinders. I don't know what's going on. Strawberry swirl. This is more of a true, like, bleach neon pink. The birthday cake was more of a fuchsia pink. It was a little bit punchier. And this is more bleached neon pink. This one needed three coats. This one was probably the most difficult to work with. It's not impossible. It's not that the formula is even bad, but it was just... It was just more sheer than I thought it would be. It's, there's still no running. It wasn't like running all over my nails, but it just needed that third coat to, uh, to kind of correct the streakiness. It was quite streaky at two coats still. So this one was three coats of strawberry swirl. What do you guys think of this collection? I personally love a bleached neon. I will never be sick of neons. I know that there are a lot of people who don't like neons. So if you don't like neons, I, you know, we know this isn't for you. That's fine. I personally love neons. I love brights. I love them, especially this time of year when I'm just dying for summer. And I personally love this. I think my favorite, oh, I don't even know. I really love the cool mint because I love like a minty, but I liked cotton candy, I liked orange cream, I even liked strawberry swirl, even though it was, you know, not, it, the, it had the worst, I, I don't want to say formula, it was the most difficult to apply, but still not impossible, you know, like if you applied enough nail polish, you're like, this is truly horrible to apply, and then this isn't like my favorite, but it's not bad, you know, it was, it was the, it's not my favorite, but it's not bad. Anyway, let me know if you guys have spotted this collection in your Walmart. I was actually shocked that my Walmart had it out already because, you know, I don't know. It just seems like they take a while to put things out. I never see Salon Perfect new displays or seasonal displays. I know I've talked about this before. We never get the seasonal glitters. Does Salon Perfect do Easter glitters? Because that would be, like, are there bunny-shaped glitters? Are there bunny shaped glitters? I need to research this. Anyway, let me know if you guys have spotted this collection, if you have purchased any of these, and what your thoughts are. I'll talk to you guys in my next video.